Hello, Daryl here from Precision Sales. Uh, right now, on the back of our, the last page of our measurement form, it asks you to take a picture of the side of your boat. The purpose of that is to check to make sure if you have a dodger that we're going to set the boom with enough clearance between the dodger and the boom. It's also to make sure that we get the boom height to where you want, where you want to have it sitting. Make sure it's not right at your head level if you want to. exactly where you want the boom to be sitting with the new sail. So in this case, we're going to have the boom sitting at this height. We know that there's enough clearance between the boom and the dodger. A lot of times the dodger is actually a lot closer to the boom, so that's where you probably want to lift the boom up an inch and a half or two inches just to be safe and make sure that nothing will ever rub on the boom. On the last page again, we do have a picture of looking for the profile. Um, as shown in the picture, the boom length and the mass. So you might have to go back and on some of the boat and get a side view picture of the mass and the boom. So we can calculate the angle between the boom and the mast. It's really simple. We just ask for a couple pictures and we'll do the rest of the work for you.